Hello everyone, this is Nirmal here for Technique and today we are going to unbox the Moto E 2015 version. So that's the second generation Moto E which was announced uh, last month and uh, it was announced in India a couple of days back. So we have the 3G variant uh, with us right now. So Motorola has announced the 3G variant in India and it's price 699. So this is available exclusively on Flipkart just like our previous generation Motorola phones. So we have the Moto E, so the box packing is exactly similar to uh, the previous generation one and uh, there are a couple of changes with respect to the hardware and also the design aspect. So we'll uh, quickly have a look at uh, uh, the hardware aspect as well as uh, the software which is Android 5.0 Lollipop and also the design changes with respect to the first generation model. So here are the quick specs, it's mentioned uh, the 4.5 inch QHD display with Corning Gorilla Glass 3 protection. So the display size has been increased from 4.3 to 4.5 but the resolution remains the same so that's the QHD uh, 540 by 960 pixels so that's the same resolution then it has the water resistant coating inside out so that again uh, was available on the first generation as well then you have the powerful 1.2 gigahertz code core snapdragon 200 chipset and the first generation had a dual core chipset now we have uh, the code core chipset then uh, pure android experience that's the stock android android 5.0 lollipop and the 5 megapixel rear camera plus a front facing VGA camera. So the 5 megapixel camera is now out of focus, still there is no flash and there is an uh, VGF camera included, uh, that's new addition. Then uh, the storage has been up from 4GB uh, to 8GB on this device. So this is the 3G variant. Uh, so let's get started with unboxing. So let's uh, open the box and see the device. So, there you go. so that's the new Moto E. So you can see there is a, uh, the specs are written on the front screen 4.5 inch quad core 2390 milliamp hour battery. So battery has been also increased dual sim card SD card and a dual camera front and rear casing camera. So the design wise there is uh, some change here so you can see the rear panel has gone in for a change. So you can see the textured finish around uh, uh, the device uh, then uh, you also have a silver finishing. Uh, on the buttons so the power and the volume key on the right side the 3.5 mm audio jack on the top and the micro usb charging slot at the bottom so the batteries are already built in let's boot the device so let's peel off uh, this uh, friend uh, cover and then uh, we'll uh, boot the device so there you go it's powering on so in the meanwhile let's see what else is inside the box so we have uh, the standard earphones <laughs> So these are just a basic uh, set of earphones which were also available in the previous generation Moto E. So again the standard uh, charging cable, no inclusion of uh, USB cable. Then uh, we have the uh, warranty and guide. So that's all in the box. So let's keep these things aside and uh, see the device. So there you go. That's the new Moto E with Android 5.0 Lollipop. So you can see this is the Lollipop, the new notification center the beautiful notification center and uh, the icon so here we have the three on screen buttons home back uh, and uh, the the multitasking option so that's the software so let's just go to the settings and you can see the android 5.0 lollipop it's 5.0.2 lollipop so there you go now let's just take the camera so here we have the camera so this is now an autofocus camera. So there you go, that's the autofocus camera. So if you swipe from here, the settings, so this is the gallery, the, the option to choose uh, video as well as the photo mode. So it can record videos in 720p, that's the maximum possible. So the previous generation had uh, just 480p, so that's uh, some improvement from there. Now let's see uh, the rear panel. So here there is some changes here. So you can see this is the camera module, the 5 megapixel uh, autofocus module and the Motorola logo. And instead of removing the entire, ca uh, entire panel, so we have a band here. So that's what uh, we can remove here. So we can see here we just need to remove this panel. So this, this is probably interchangeable band. So this is the band here. So after removing the band, so these are the interchangeable bands. So we can see three slots. Uh, so this is the sim card 1, the micro SD card and the sim card 2. So these are the slots available. So instead of having the removable battery and uh, removable back panel, uh, the design has been changed and we have this band. So this is the band, the changeable band available, probably available in different colors. So that's all. So now we have inserted uh, back the rear 
uh, band now we have the device so that's the new Moto E2015 and uh, we'll, we'll just quickly have a look at uh, the storage available so you can see total of 5.03 gigabyte is available and user available is 4.61 gigabyte so that's pretty decent storage uh, out of the 8 gigabyte available so this is the new Moto E so we'll quickly have a look at uh, the, the first generation and the second generation so here we go so uh, some design changes are there it's also uh, a bit more uh, tougher to look uh, that means uh, it has a different uh, kind of finish here so it's a textured finish and this had a removable back panel it has own just a band which can be removed so and also it had a dual front facing speakers on the first generation now we have only front facing speaker on the top so that's a design change so you can see here the first generation versus the second generation Moto E so that was the quick unboxing of uh, the Moto E 2015. So this is the 3G variant. Hope you like this video. If you have any questions, just drop a comment and we'll be glad to help you out with the queries. If you like this video, do hit the like button and also subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos. Thanks for watching this video. Have a great day.